here. The wait is finally over. Milo's is back in Tuscaloosa. I'm back. Today I'm here with Tom Deakle, CEO. Tom, what does it mean to be back in Tuscaloosa? Oh, it's it's hard to hard to summarize it, but we're just extremely excited. It's been a long time coming. We've um, been waiting patiently for four years. It took us a while to get a, the, the right site selection, and, uh, and we're finally back. We love we love where we are. You know, it's easy for not only the city uh, to get to us, but even the county and surrounding areas. Well, it's a fantastic location because What's our that? office is maybe less than half a oh. mile down there. It's so great to have you back in town because it's really a part of Tuscaloosa to have you back and also because cheeseburgers and tea, right? Yes. There are a right, lot of right. new features in this restaurant like a sauce bar and breakfast. Can you tell us about that? Sure. Um, of course, we're all about sauce and all about tea. And one of the things that we'd always done is we had served uh, the tea from behind the counter and you had to ask for the sauces by request. We didn't have a great way to, for the customers to access them. We studied that we finally came up with a way to bring the tea out front. You still, we still give you your ice because we'll never compromise on the ice. It's a uh, flaked uh, process. And, but you get all your refills for free and all the sauces. It's really been, it's been great because a lot of customers didn't even know we had some of the sauces until they were out there. So I'm really excited. I don't think I have enough words to tell you. Milo's has been gone for about four years. When I was pregnant, it's all I craved. So every trip to the doctor's office in Birmingham was a trip to Milo's. But now it's here. Yep. And you guys are officially open tomorrow, right? Officially open tomorrow. So come on, come on. We'll be there. Thank you so much for taking time to speak thank with you us very today. Much. Yeah, thank you.